Late today, the safety board said that a technology called positive train control could have prevented the accident. But the president of Amtrak said they've had technical problems installing that system along the treacherous Philadelphia curve. We asked Omar Villafranca to tell us more. It was 2008 when the engineer of this Los Angeles commuter train missed a warning signal while texting and collided with a freight train. The 25 deaths prompted Congress to pass strict new safety guidelines. A safety system called Positive Train Control, or PTC, may have prevented that accident. It is now in use in Southern California and can stop or start the train by computer, avoiding human error. Metrolink spokesman Jeff Lustgarten. When you have a system like PTC in place, speed won't be an issue. The train will be able to operate safely at, at maximum speeds. GPS technology transmits signals from thousands of track sensors to a central computer system. The system looks at the size of the train, the weight of the train, and the speed of the train at all times. RT McCarthy is director of operations for Metrolink. Using this simulator, he showed us how PTC relays crucial information to the train's engineer. What it was telling me is you're going too fast for this curve. I won't let you take this curve. Warning lights and beeps tell the engineer how many seconds he has to break before the computer takes over. If at any time I am unable to stop the train, positive train control then takes command, stops the train to prevent any type of incident or accident. That was not the case in the Bronx, New York. This 2013 crash left four passengers dead. The NTSB says it was one of 29 rail disasters in the past decade that could have been avoided with PTC. While positive train control offers safety, it is also costly, $50,000 a mile. Scott, the Association of American Railroads says $5 billion has already been spent, and that only covers 60% of the trains. And Amtrak says it'll have positive train control on the Northeast Corridor in about a year. Omar, thank you very much.